We're gonna run Freedom 115 grain. This is the DPM systems. We're gonna test out the Glock 19 Gen 3 and Gen 5. We also have a tungsten guide rod from the Glock store and the OEM plastic guide rod. Both of those will be controlled. We're at the Okeechobee gun range today. The weather hasn't been great lately, and we're going to try and squeeze this range day in. Now, we're going to start with the OEM plastic guide rod, Glock 19 Gen 5. We're with Alex. What's your status, Alex? I'm a Marine, been an expert shooter for uh, over 10 years in, the, in the, uh, the rifle and handgun for the Marine Corps, and so I'm just excited to be here. See how it's going. This will be the plastic guide rod. I'd rather be with that dude right there. Okay, we're going to go head to head with the OEM guide rod with the DPM. The Glock 19, Alex runs a Gen 5, he's going to swap them out. Alex, what's your status with the Marine Corps? Sure, Nick. Yeah, I've been in the Marine Corps for almost 12 years, and every year that we shoot rifle and pistol, I've been an expert, so I'm excited to see what this new spring does. Great. And this would be DPM. What do you think about the DPM systems for the Glock 19 Gen 5? You know, I feel like uh, it's less recoil for sure, and I feel like I'm able to really get into the center. As you can see, you know, my previous shooting was kind of, kind of towards the left down, and so bottom left right there. But this time I was actually able to get a little bit closer to the center. Wow, and it shows. Yeah, and it was it's pretty comfortable getting in there too, so. Wow, nice work. Yeah, thank you. We move over to my Glock Gen 3. It's Glock 19. Same shooter, Alex. And again, he had comments about that Gen 5. Again, the yeah. DPM systems. Yeah, you know, th this is a 9mm handgun, and everyone, know everyone knows what it feels like. But when I shot the DPM uh, spring, it just felt like it was a, a, a smaller size round, kind of like maybe a 22. So I was able to get back on target really quick, and I was comfortable with it. So. It was very surprising. I've never, you know, experienced any handgun. And it's probably not as snappy. Right, exactly, yeah. Cool, let's move over to the Gen 3 now. We're going to move to the left target. This is the OEM. We're going to move over to my Glock 19 Gen 3. We're going to move over to the Glock 19 Gen 3 with the OEM guide rod. Now, Alex, you wanted to mention something about that previous Gen 5 Glock DPM system. Sure, Nick. Yeah, so everyone knows what a 9mm feels like, especially Glock. It's actually very common. Um, after shooting so much and, you know, for a long period of time, I, I've gotten the feel of the 9mm and, and it feels a certain way, but with this new DPM spring, it, it almost feels like I'm shooting a, a 22, so it's easier for me to get back on target, take the next shot, and make sure it's not going you know, elsewhere other than center target. So it's a, it's a pleasure to shoot it, for sure. And this will be the OEM guide rod for the Glock 19 Gen 3. but a little spread out. We're gonna do the Glock Store Super Heavy Tungsten Guide Rod now. This will be the Gen 3 Glock 19. About five rounds, left target. So what do you think? 
same deal. I feel like spring helps the recoil a lot. And what I mean by that is there's less recoil and it's easier to just back on target. You know, that's important in any self-defense type of competition. So, Relative to OEM. I'm sorry? Relative to OEM. Correct, yes. Compared, comparing to the OEM, it's a, it's a lot easier to get back on target. And you know, that, that's important in a lot of factors. So this is great. It'll be interesting because we're going to move on to the DPM uh, system for the Glock 19 Gen 3. We're going to move on to the DPM systems for the Glock 19 Gen 3. We're going to shoot five in the left target. Much tighter. Now, what, what's your opinion between the DPM and the Glock store tungsten? You know, Nick, uh, after trying the three springs, you know, it gets a little bit better, but once you go into the DPM spring, it just it just takes it. There's no competition whatsoever. You know, the groupings, they're a lot better when, when it's a DPM spring. The recoil, it's easier to get back to center target, as I mentioned before. And so, no, it's exciting, you know, to continue training on this spring, and I hope that other people are able to kind of you know, take this and try it out. Great. Thanks for helping us. Absolutely. Thank <laughs> you.